YouTube Magic Hour. Watch Technically Speaking on YouTube. Faux Reels. What's up, everybody? This is Scott, and welcome back to another video. Well, life is hard, and I'm going to show you in today's video how to make your life a little bit easier because I love you. Yeah, no, no, you. No, no, you. Ah, oh, fine, I love you all. As you know, the Google Assistant is far and away the most helpful assistant, but now with Google Routines, this is a refresh on a video that I made last year. I'm gonna show you how to insert your own custom routine, kind of like the one that you just heard, as well as utilize all the goodies that are within the Google Home app for routines. So Google Routines actually allows you to trigger multiple things to turn on at once. Like you heard, she was talking about how you should watch the channel, the lights came on over here and over there. So long story short, I gave one command and I was able to turn all of those things on. That's not all. You can also get weather, sports updates, turn on media, set alarms, change the thermostat, look at your front door. There's a lot of things that you can do with Google Routines. When you open up the Google Home app, you're going to see routines right there in the middle of the screen and there are six ready-made routines that Google has already pre-populated for you. They range from good morning, bedtime, leaving home, I'm home, commuting to work, and then commuting back home either from work or somewhere where you are. So dependent upon what you wanna to try to do, one of those routines might work out for you. So let's go ahead and take a peek at the good morning routine. So when you look at my good morning routine, when I first say good morning or tell me about my day or I'm up, I can trigger the assistant to take my phone off of silent, whether I wanna turn the volume all the way up to 100 or I wanna turn it down somewhere in the more manageable range. I can turn the lights on, the plugs, or anything more that I might have, and you can see in the app right now, light strip, nano leaf, these are all my studio lights that I have, plus some basement lights that I have downstairs. I can adjust my thermostat. Oh, 72, that is way too hot, so let's turn that down to I don't know, a manageable 68 degrees when I wanna turn the thermostat on when I get ready to leave the house. I could have it tell me about my weather, tell me about the commute to my work, or give me calendar events and reminders that I have. After that, I wanna to listen to my either my favorite podcast or audiobook so I can program any of those that I wanna say, like so I could choose last played podcast or I wanna go play some music. So I can programmatically tell Google to go in, open up my Google Music app and play that sweet playlist that I have. So then once I hit save, when I give the action of good morning or tell me about my day or I'm up, it's gonna do each one of those things. Now let's take a peek at the commuting to work. If I go into commuting to work and say, let's go to work, Google's immediately gonna tell me about my commute to work. So it's gonna tell me how many minutes that I have if traffic is bad or anything like that. It's gonna give me a weather update and then tell me about today's calendar. After that, I can have adjust adjustment of any lights, thermostat, scenes, or media volume. And then I just have it play music. Tend to, when I'm in the car and stuck in traffic, I like to just listen to some music. So I just kind of jam out with those sweet 80s tunes. Because I'm an 80s baby, what can I say? Now that I've showed you the already existing routines, let's talk about a custom routine. That's one you basically build from scratch. So when you go into the Google Home app, you open up the app itself, and you're gonna see right there in the middle of the screen, probably in purple, at least it is for me, routines. So I'm gonna hit those routines, and you're gonna immediately see a list of routines that you have. So you can see the six that are already populated by Google, plus that one that I already have, YouTube Magic Hour. If I wanna manage those, I'm gonna hit Manage Routines at the bottom, and in the bottom right hand corner, you're gonna see the plus mark. We're gonna hit that plus mark and this is where you're gonna start a brand new routine. So when I wanna make this new routine, I'm gonna add the command of, hmm, let's see, mischief managed. So for mischief managed, I'm gonna go ahead and say that I want the assistant to, let's choose some popular actions that it has here on the page. I want it to turn off my studio lights. So I'm gonna go in and select the light strip in my studio, I'm gonna have it turn it off. The nano leaf, I'm gonna have it turn off. Studio one, off. Studio three, off. Studio two, off. No change on my other basement lights. I'm gonna have the thermostat go down to a nice and balmy 66, cause you know, I like it cold in my house. You can plan your day, you can have it communicate different type of things, send text messages, read any un unanswered text that you may have, put my phone on silent, take it off, but here's where I'm gonna get it. I want Google to tell me something really, really funny. So I'm gonna go in here and say, and we're gonna see what I added just in one hot second. So now that I have my mischief manage routine, I'm gonna go hit save in the upper right hand corner. And now let's give it a shot. 
Mischief Managed. Yes, sir, your majesty. YouTube Magic Hour. Watch Technically Speaking on YouTube. Faux Reels. Faux Reels. So that's it, that's today's video about Google routines, kind of the refresh of the last one that I made and making custom Google routines that you can do cool things like I just did. So that's it, that's all I have. As always, like, share, subscribe, thumbs up, leave a comment below, and we will see you next time.